Hi, I'd like to present you my project in which I try to integrate this great machine that's called Raspberry Pi 400 and this great keyboard Keychron C1. Well, first of all, I'd like to apologize for my English. I'm from Czech Republic and I'm not used to speak in English very often. But I thought that maybe some other people from different country could be interested in this project and therefore I decided to record this video in English language. Okay, so the idea of having computer integrated directly in the keyboard is quite old. You know, the vintage computers like Amiga, Atari, ZX Spectrum and many others use this concept. Uh, I have one sample of this computer, it's called Didactic Amp and it's actually Czech version of ZX Spectrum and I'm very proud of that. Actually it was my first computer that I had. Uh, well, I was very happy that a company that produced Raspberry Pi creates this model Raspberry Pi 400 that integrates computer and keyboard. The only one downgrade uh, is the keyboard. The keyboard is like notebook keyboard and I really don't like it and I think that I'm not the only one who doesn't like the keyboard. And there, were, there was this, the reason why I've tried to find some replacement and I've found it. It's Keychron C1. This keyboard is a mechanical keyboard. Wow. It's backlighted. It has a really nice clicky sound. Listen. Cool. Yeah. You know you have like retro feeling when you are typing on this keyboard instead of this original from P400. Okay, if you would like to know if it's easy to integrate P400 in this keyboard, then I have to say that no, it's not easy. It's not difficult, but definitely not easy. The reason is that in the keyboard isn't enough room you have to do several modifications. In my case, I removed the, the Ethernet port, the GPIO port, I replaced the heatsink and did many other modifications in order to have the possibility to put this machine inside of this keyboard. But the result is quite good, I think. Okay, from the outside, it looks like normal keyboard Keychron C1. The difference is on the back side, where you can see the, the ports, USB ports and some others, and it comes from Raspberry Pi 400. And how it works? Well, let's have a look. So. <laughs>